After the collapse of the French regime in Canada, their place was taken over by Scottish traders who formed the Northwest Company. And by the 1790s, the Hudson's Bay Company and the Northwest Company were going tooth and nail in a war to control the fur trade across Canada. And the Hudson's Bay Company issued swords to their top officers. This sword was given to John S. McNabb, whose portrait appears on the cover of our magazine. McNabb was a medical doctor by profession, but he rose high in the Hudson's Bay Company. There are only two of these swords known to exist today. One of them is in the Hudson's Bay Company collection, and this one at the Museum of the Fur Trade.